on this week's news update. A trash sorting robot. A baby dancing lemur. And revolutionizing future farming. First up, technology is advancing every day. Many machines use computers to help them perform complex tasks. These computers use artificial intelligence to learn by themselves, much like humans do. Now, artificial intelligence, or AI, is helping robots sort out our trash, working to reduce the amount sent to landfill. The robots use artificial intelligence to spot different types of materials. For example, cardboard, plastic, and aluminum. They then pick them out from a conveyor belt of unsorted trash. Each robot in an assembly line can be instructed to pick up one specific type of material to sort the trash quickly and efficiently. The freshly sorted trash is then bundled into bales of paper, plastic, and aluminum, ready to be recycled and reused. Up next, it's Animal Watch. Meet cockerel shifaka lemurs or dancing lemurs, as they're also known because of their spring-like walk. These beautiful animals are only found in the wild in Madagascar, and they have become an endangered species. To save them from extinction, conservationists set up a breeding program, and their efforts paid off. This is the first dancing lemur to be born in Europe to proud parents Beatrice and Elliot. Their precious youngster, who is yet to be named, will cling to its mother's belly for the first few weeks. Conservationists won't know the sex of the baby until it begins to move around on its own. But no matter the outcome, experts believe this birth is a key moment for the endangered species. And finally, farming is vital for humans to produce food. But natural disasters can destroy crops and reduce the amount of essential food grown. To preserve the food we grow, scientists have developed a new way to farm using biopods. These pods create the ideal growing conditions for plants anywhere in the world. The temperature, humidity, and even lighting inside the pod are all controlled to ensure the best crop growth. The pod is built to withstand extreme climates and uses far less land and water than existing farming methods. This makes them much more efficient and less vulnerable to natural disasters. Scientists hope that these pods can help solve global food problems and one day could even be used to grow plants on the moon. That's all for this week. We'll see you next time.